Hey YouTubers, diecast collectors, fellow J-Rods. I just finished my uh, gingerbread house, my cookie house. There's the front and I did icing drips all over the roof and the uh, candy corns right there. And all the little bats. I got the front doors with the spider webs and the bricks. So yeah, it turned out real good. I was really happy with the results of this kit. It's nice that they include icing with actual tips with this one because some of them they just make you put the icing goes in a bag and uh, it's harder to use a bag than it is icing tips. But the gravestone turned out really good. I'm super proud of that. I am pretty much proud of everything I did. I thought it turned out better than the picture actually. But there's the front, and I had to lean the gravestone against this, uh, or my mom had to lean the gravestone against this cap, the icing cap, so it wouldn't tip over. And then there's a side window. It's really not much, but it's right there, and I, I didn't do the cracks, but that's okay. I don't mind, because I didn't really have enough icing to do cracks on this side, but that's okay. And still turned out great and then I got the icing drips right there more drips in the back more of the bats I got some candy corns in the back windows more spider webs I thought the spider webs in the back here to actually turn out a little bit better and then there's the other side and see this I actually have some small cracks but you really can't tell so there's not too much of a difference between this side and the other side and then we're back to the front again so anyway let me know what you think of my uh, horror gingerbread house. I thought it turned out, our cookie house, I thought it turned out really good. And I had a good Halloween, went to some mazes, and uh, I went to go see the movie Halloween. So if you get the chance, go and check that out. I won't give any spoilers, but uh, you definitely gotta see that. Anyway guys, have a good one. Bye.